Remove the bearing frame and impeller assembly. Remove the support foot cap screws. Loosen the volute cap screws, but do not remove them. Use the cap screws in the jack screw holes for all models except for the 1510-8G. Loosen the bearing frame and impeller assembly from the volute. Remove the seal flushing tube if it is used. Remove the volute cap screws. Remove the bearing frame and impeller assembly from the volute. Remove the impeller. For all models except the 1510-8G, remove the impeller cap screw. Remove the lock washer and the washer. Remove the bearing bracket cap screws from the cover plate. Using a gear puller, pull on the back side of the cover plate to remove the impeller, mechanical seal rotating assembly, and cover plate from the bearing frame assembly. Remove the impeller. Remove the rotating portion of the mechanical seal. If necessary, use a screwdriver to loosen the rubber ring. Remove the impeller key. Remove the cover plate from the bearing frame assembly. Remove the seal insert, the insert gasket, and the retainer if it is used. Then remove the fiber gasket from the face of the cover plate. If damaged, it should be replaced with a new one. 